That's when Big Jack turned tail and run. There I was, boys alone, in the middle of Main Street, plumb surrounded by three of the worst bounty hunters in the West, chewed their own can for six bits and a worn-out saddle. And there I stood my ground, and they was a-coming, step by step, moving in for the kill. I had my old double-barrel flintlock stuck in the belt, just waiting for them to make the move. And sure enough, they did. Boom! Boom! And when the smoke had all cleared, all three of them had stretched out in the street, cold in an icicle on the end of your nose. Ah, come on, Sully. How could you kill three fellas with only a double-barrel flintlock pistol? Well, if you wasn't so all-fired busy going no place, Bobby Dan, the fella might get a chance to finish what he's telling you. Well, go on, finish it. Oh, well, um... Oh, uh... Yeah, I waited till two of them got in line. One right behind the other. And that big old bullet went plumb through them both. Sorry, Hubbard, you're the biggest liar in Sunville. Every time a paper comes to town with the name of some outlaw fellow in it, you claim you know him. Just like today, you read where this big jack robs a bank in silo and you come up with another humdinger. It's the truth. Hogwash. We've been listening to your stories for 15 years and we don't believe none of them. Well, why do you listen to them? Cause we ain't got nothing else to do. We can always get a bath or a bank drink. My son, that's exactly. Hey, doll. Can I get you a drink, honey? Hey, you uh, Yeah, we'll have a beer, a couple of beers. Come right up. Guess who's sitting right up there? Go on, guess who? I don't know. Big Jack, that's who. Oh, stop it, will you? I'm telling you, that's Big Jack. Then why don't you go on over and say howdy? Oh, well, go on. Well, I would, but he'd probably pretend he didn't know me. Him being embarrassed and all, uh, about running out on me that way. Well, there's only one way to find out. Go on. Go on. Come on, fellas, fellas. Psst. Go on. Big Jack, long time no see. Huh? Oh, come on, Jack. Don't pretend you don't know old Saudi. I'm willing to let bygones be bygones. I'll buy you a beer for old time's sake, Jack. <laughs> old timer, I think you mistook me for somebody else. My name's Hoss Cartwright. Oh. Still using those phony aliases, yeah? You always was one for picking funny names. About time you come to pay me a visit. Well, look, I, I don't know if this is some sort of a joke or what, but I ain't that big jack fella. We're just passing through. We got some business to bank, then we'll be on our way. Oh, well, you don't have to worry. You're among friends here, Jack. Uh, how much you getting that job at Silo? Look, old timer, I'm gonna tell you one more time. I, I ain't never had a job in Silo. No. Big I am, but Jack, I ain't. Uh, old timer, you ought to go a little easy on that booze when he's 
Hot summer afternoon, smoke candle. Let's go to the hotel and get that bath. <laughs> Thank you.